But uh, his other one was Gordon Hayward, Wiggins, or Tobias Harris. I'm Give still, me Hayward. I, I, yep, same. Give me Tobias. And Wiggins, it's not, it's not, a, it's not an easy cut. I go, I go that direction. Hayward, Tobias. I also like Tobias because I can play him um, in multiple, multiple ways. Tobias is pretty solid. Yeah, he's just not I couldn't you, tell in that Boston series. He's just not what you trying. <laughs> all the motherfuckers in that Boston series wasn't hooping. Uh, I'm, take, I'm so starting Gordon Hayward. That's that's solid matters at the end of the day. And Demios, you were trying to talk shit about Tobias Harris before he even played in that series, which makes me think you don't even watch. I just knew he wasn't going. He ain't that, bro. He is not that. You just knew he wasn't that. You trying to put him in a situation to where you just just make it seem like you don't watch basketball to that level. But it, when you, you try to say that, like, but when you look at it, P, was I wrong? Is your first option? Were was you I right? wrong? Were you right? Yes, he didn't do shit. You said you needed him to be a, a, a option that he's never been. Why would you? Why would? Yes, you? they needed that. Did they not need him to step his game up with Ben Simmons being out and be a good? I, I'm not option. asking a motherfucker who I've never seen do something be that. That like that's like going we to the gym. With, we saw it from him when he was that's with the like, Clippers. He thrived when he was with the Clippers. He was the no, number not. one, they number one, number two option. He was. Yeah, was like 21 points a game. They had a good team. It was yeah, but he was he was legitimately good on that team. He was averaging like over twenty a game. He's good on the 76ers. But Tobias Harris isn't a number one option, bro. He's not. I know, I know. Joel and B was the number one option. I wanted him to be like the good number two. That, that he's he's not even really that. He's just a solid basketball player. What Derek is saying is that on the Clippers he was the number two. And what I'm saying is they had a good overall team. Some nights he wasn't but the number. Philly, two. Philly got a good team even without Ben Simmons there. They have a good roster. They're not as good as when he is there. That's, well, that's, obviously, obviously, but like yeah. if you take it, if you had a series of last year's Clippers versus mm-hmm. this year's 76ers without Ben Simmons, that's like a seven game series. Like those teams would be comp- like you know those teams are close. I, I I would hope, but that's hard to say because which team is Tobias playing for? Because the Clippers play for both, they put them on both rosters. <laughs> see, see so what I mean, you get. It, it, it's hard to say because without Joel and B, he's gonna he's gonna have a much more opportunity with that Clippers. It was just a more fluent offense. It wasn't the same type of thing. And I feel like without Ben Simmons, they had him kind of try to be like ball in his hands. That that's not Tobias. That's not how I want him to play. And when you have him there, your your, ex, your expectations of him doing something that he's never done before, I just don't get. I mean, he can only do what he can do, but I don't like Tobias Harris in that role with the ball in his hands. And that's mm-hmm. not who I, I don't like him like that. <laughs> I feel like yeah. he had to do more of that because Ben Simmons was out. We'll, we'll get to it, but anyway. You have Kevin Durant? Yeah. Oh, I don't yeah, have Kevin Durant because he's not playing. He, I didn't, yeah, we're not going to see him at all yeah. next season. What did so. you have him, though? I had him number three. Kevin Durant's number three. Whoa. Above Kawhi? Kawhi um, above him. Um, oh, that's disrespectful. I'm How's sorry. that disrespectful? I ain't going to go as Kawhi's the best yeah. two-way player in the NBA. <laughs> Yeah, but what? He's been really elite, like the, he, he has been the best perimeter defender for like best, four years. He's the best two-way player Kevin Durant. <laughs> Kevin Durant is also an elite defender in his own right. No, he's not elite. Come he's on, Derek. He's a he's a very on, he's, he's a not, very good defender. He's a good defender. He's, he's, not, he's, he's not a rim protector. He's not a rim protector. He's an elite scorer. I can tell you that he's, though. He's, he's, he's better scorer than Kawhi Leonard. <laughs> he is he's a better scorer than okay, Kawhi Leonard. Then. But okay, I take so you, everything into consideration. When you got Kawhi Leonard, who's the defensive player of the year, he's the best def- perimeter right. defender we have in the NBA. Right. And, and I, he also dropped twenty eight a night. What what else do you want from him? Kevin Durant is also Kevin Durant is just literally better. He's a literally he's a better scorer. He's a better scorer. And it's not like. The, his defense is hot. Kawhi's defense is way it, better I'm, than I'm, Kevin Durant. I don't need that. Yes. <laughs> but it's I like Katie's defense now. almost takes nothing away from him. He can block. No, he can no, protect no, no, the paint. No, no, no. I'm so nothing. I want to see the same shit. Nothing that I. That's what I'm saying. So it's like almost a balance. If Kawhi is an elite defender. So if it's a balance, then why is my pick at Kawhi number two absurd? If it's a balance, I'm Katie's been to his whole career. He's literally second to the We're not talking. We're talking about this right now. I have Kawhi in a higher. You're acting like I said Kawhi's a ten and Kevin Durant's a three. I don't know, one, they're one they next to each other. I don't the Ke- LeBron and Katie is legitimately like the, the one two. Yeah. In my eyes, I have Kawhi Leonard number two. Is that wrong? 
it's not I wrong, but it's it's also not right at the same time. I think y'all should continue to have the discussion though. Why is Kawhi your number two? I just said he's the best two way player in the NBA. Why is Durant above him? Because because he's saying that Durant's a better scorer. He is. He's is literally the he's literally the second best player in the league. One hundred percent, I agree that he is a better scorer. Better but scorer. if I'm talking about all around game, okay. At this well, point all, in time, all around, all, I'm who's a better Kawhi, who, who's a better playmaker though? Who Kevin Durant's Kevin Durant. a better playmaker? Okay, who's probably a better shot blocker? Kevin Durant. <laughs> Kevin Durant. That's Kevin, like Kevin Durant is probably the shot. Say, I better shot. But are you talking about all the rain games? Why does that matter? Because you brought you talking. Let's let's cut. Let, let, let's right. I'm, I'm gonna let y'all. I'm just going through aspects wait, of the wait, game. Wait, wait, it's y'all argument, but I'm gonna just referee. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. So for, we're not gonna do that, Mike. Defense is defense. We're not just going. Right. Who's, who's, a, better, <laughs> who's okay. a better pick and roll defense? No. I'm talking about a player that can play. You could literally put him almost at any player in the floor. He could play defense except for maybe the center spot. Kawhi Leonard is just two inches shorter, so he don't got the wingspan. Right, and that's why I'm giving. You, the so of doubt. You're gonna act like Kawhi Leonard hasn't switched onto guards and clamped up. He, he hasn't has. switched onto bigs and he clamped has. up. They That's both what have. He does. They both have done that. I've seen but both Kawhi of them do that. Kawhi has done it at an elite All level. Right. Kevin Durant has done it at a good level for two years. All Kawhi right. has been an elite defender for four fucking years. He One has. of those years, he was the best defender in the entire league. He has. I'm saying Kevin Durant has earned that number two spot of what he's done, his I'm skill level, his size. So, you have right. your opinion. That's okay. cool. But at my opinion, Kawhi Leonard is the so second is best Ka- small four in the league right now. So is he the second best player in the league? He would have to. Yeah. yeah. Nah. All right, because he's Giannis. Yeah, what? I would have him at number two. Yes, I would I, have him as the second best player in the league. Two at, yeah. be the second best player when Giannis is, has to be. Unless yeah. you're just saying Giannis is the third player. Giannis. Kawhi is over KD Giannis. is the second best player. That's what I'm saying. Oh, then you're, then you're and you're you're, you're completely okay to have that opinion. No, I don't think nobody is trying to say you. Well, right. No, he said, said yeah, he did say that. He did. First, first of all, he but, said but, Kevin Durant is an elite but defender. But you know, he just blurted out shit. <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> he Kevin Durant is not that. elite. He had a couple good defensive years, which is great. That's good for him because mm-hmm. he's never known as a defender until the last couple years. But Kawhi Leonard. Even when he first came into the league, you look at a scout report, everybody knew he was going to be an elite right. defender. I mean, he's, and he, he has been. Right. It's even Entire that clip, career. That clip where he, he's about to check in the game, LeBron James looked back and he's like, fuck. fuck. Yeah. Yeah, we know about that's that. That's what defense. Kawhi do. He, yeah. Two-time finals MVP. I, that's, that's, that's insane with two different teams. But I'm going to give it to Kevin Durant. And y'all are completely okay with having <laughs> No, no, no. And nobody's saying nobody's wrong, but this is what we do. It's just the, the arguing debate shit. If for some reason, because people watch this and don't think we're supposed to get yeah, arguing debate. But... Um, Kevin Durant isn't the level defender that Kawhi is, mm-hmm. but since Durant turned his defense up, and rightfully so, it's easy to do that when you're on the Golden State Warriors because you're not uh, asserting so much energy on the offensive level. Kawhi is doing it regardless. Mm-hmm. But his scoring is just so crazy and so on another level that it's just like the fact that his his defense being good just makes him better because mm-hmm. like. He his scoring Kawhi his scoring is nowhere near Durant. I'm no. sorry. He had if, a nice little breakout in the playoffs. Kevin Durant's probably the best score I've seen other than Kobe. Um, yeah. Like it's literally he's got every tool to be a great but scorer. Also he but he also has an Achilles injury. So mm-hmm. I mean he does. And, and Kawhi just had one of the best playoff runs in the history of basketball. But that's that's the unfortunate thing about this league is that the top players are that good where you can have that run and still be like the third best small forward to some people. But, you know, Kevin Durant is hurt, so he's not on my list, but. I think I think a team that can be like um, a good matchup against y'all is the Suns. I'm not saying I will pick the the Suns over the Lakers, but that's a series right there. That's a series. Those are the two teams that I'd probably be most scared of is Denver and Phoenix. Mm. Um, Also, I think. It, if I had to go by tears, I'd say Denver and Phoenix, just because, like I said, they're as about as complete as can be. Utah and Clipper, the Utah and Clippers are probably about the the tier two teams I'd be worried about against the Lakers. Really, I would be very scared to go against Kawhi and Paul George in the series for the first round. And Boogie, don't forget. Yeah, he too, D man. <laughs> I would take Kawhi and Paul George over those other teams. I don't know. I, I I don't know. It's not it's not as much fear in my heart against some Clippers teams. Mm. I think that they still gonna resort resort back to their old ways when it comes playoff time, which isn't a bad thing. Having Paul George or Kawhi just be like old ways. bad bad offense when it comes down to when they really do need to score. You oh, know, okay. you know, every team does the same thing when it's time to get a basket, right? But they're gonna give their best player the ball and say, "Get us a basket." Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. It's just it's just whether or not you trust Kawhi or Paul George to get that basket. I trust Kawhi. Paul George is sometimes a question mark, but he can still do that, the same thing hey, too. I like the Lakers. 
But y'all don't have no motherfuckers. Y'all don't have the clutches player in the league. Y'all don't have Damian Lillard. We we don't. But right. we, we don't execute that. We don't have we don't we don't have it. But we execute down the damn stretch. I'll tell you that. I don't fucking execute, man. We don't. Y'all literally you crazy. Just, we do that shit all. We've been doing this shit all season, bro. Y'all don't execute, bro. Y'all listen. Y'all are a very good team, but y'all ain't the the best execution team or some shit. Y'all won because y'all played against some teams that y'all was better than. Y'all should have beaten. And y'all did y'all thing. I'm not taking no credit away from the Lakers. They they won a championship. But the, what all I'm saying is the shit you taking from other teams can be applied to the Lakers. LeBron James ain't no motherfucker with five, ten seconds left. He just watch out. We we going home. I love LeBron, but that ain't him. Anthony Davis. Neither is he. He hit that shot against the Nuggets, but he ain't no motherfucker where five seconds left. Hey, move. AD finna take us home. Just get out of his way. And he just, just, no, no. The only teams that have that are the Brooklyn Nets and the Portland Trailblazers. The rest of the teams, uh, Clippers and and, and fucking uh, Clippers, Kawhi and Paul George, I'm taking my days with that. I'll, I'll live with that. The Suns, Chris Paul. But like, yeah, a lot of motherfuckers that you trying to like knock again. The Nuggets don't really have that. Yeah, they, they, they Jokic, will, Jokic will Jokic will game Jokic, Jokic will game a motherfucker. Bro. Jokic statistically is the most clutch player in the last three seasons. But it are you trusting Jokic ten times more than you trusting Kawhi? They're in the same tier to me. I think they're in the same tier. Damn, they are. He's about to argue that shit though. I mean, can you answer my question? Don't I'm fuck still with at, at this point in time. I'm still taking quite to take my I last want to hear shot. Mike's question. Now, don't go off what Contreras saying. What is your answer? I'm still taking Kawhi letter at this point. Okay, because then. So, it's asking for his own shot. So, so what were you saying? So, what are you saying? Jokic still has proven that his ass can hit plenty of games. I'm still... not saying that he couldn't, bro. I, obviously, I know this. I, I know, I know. But I'm asking you because you're talking down on the team. Saying you don't, you, they're gonna go back to their old ways. But then you say you have fear with the Nuggets. But I, I'm, I just asked you, and you say you take Kawhi. So what the fuck is your argument then? I don't understand. The reason I say the Nuggets is because they damn offense is bad. Their offense is, I think, their offense, their offense is historically great right now. But the, that's what I'm saying. I'm trusting that shit down the stretch compared to the Clippers. You said a lot of teams do the same things when it comes down to the last shot and getting a bucket. Mm-hmm. So they historical offense don't really mean shit. The, the the Mavs had a historical offense, but you know what they did for the last play of the game? Luca stepped back and shot a fucking three. They didn't say, "Hey, run the motion offense for this last sec- this shot." The Clippers' offense is better than the Nuggets' offense this season. What do you fucking know? <laughs> so now, what's your argument? The way the the way the Nuggets run their offense, I'm taking that shit. I'm okay. taking the way they are. Jokic running all them, all them people running off all them no scores. Problem, I'm no taking problem. that shit. I'm okay. taking that shit over isolation buckets every right. for the last five minutes of the game, bro. I'm taking that shit. But what Pierre is saying is that every team kind of stops running sets like the last five minutes of the game, and they. Kind wait, of- wait, wait. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I misspoke. The Denver Nuggets offensive rating is one point seven one seventeen point three. The Clippers is one seventeen even, so they have a point three better offense the Denver Nuggets do than than the, I was looking at the last couple um a, a smaller sample size in the entire season. I don't understand why the the Clippers are just like a shrug, but you scared of the Suns and Nuggets. <laughs> yeah. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm, I'm not even saying the Lakers would lose, but I don't understand that argument. Like. That's just like a Twitter Laker fan. Like, oh, we scared of these teams, but fuck the Clippers because they the Clippers and they're our rivals. So we just no, act like the Clippers don't no, exist. I'm saying down the stretch, down the stretch, I do not trust, I do not trust the Clippers, bro. Okay. When it's going to come to regular season, I'm telling all that regular season, I, I don't care about with them. When it comes to the playoffs Kawhi times. More than Jokic. What? But you just told me you trust Kawhi more than Jokic. You just told me. Yes, you was I do. Kawhi. Jokic, Jokic is literally, Jokic is literally playing MVP basketball, like, one of the best offensive juggernauts we've seen. I know this. Really ever. Telling me shit I Literally know. Ever. No, but, you I'm rolling up with that. Take, but you just told me you would take Kawhi then. That was, for a game for a game winning shot. Yeah, I'm gonna take Kawhi. I'm taking Kawhi Leonard for a game winning shot. Don't trust it, but you trust the Nuggets more down the stretch when you're taking but a game winning shot in like four or five minutes down. Two, four, five, bro, four or five four or five minutes down the stretch of a fourth quarter is different from just a man taking the last shot. No, nah, his argument. 
Okay. No argument you, just change, you just changed the argument then. Okay. <laughs> what are you talking, bro? That makes make more sense. That makes more sense. I, That's the whole know. thing I was arguing. You said the last, there's a difference between the last, I said down the stretch, I touched the Nuggets more but than, I mean, more, more than the Nuggets. Last shots is down the stretch. I'm not changing. It like, is. It is. Yeah, the last four or five minutes of a game. Mm -hmm. That That's a whole other, but down even, the stretch, bro, hey, you even when they say bucket, clutch, you putting that motherfucker. When they say clutch guys, buckets, you putting even that motherfucker. Clutch guys. buckets. Yes. Who you take? Who you taking? For a clutch bucket, I'm taking Kawhi Leonard. That's down the stretch. I've seen Kawhi down the stretch. down the stretch plenty of times. The fuck? Hey, that's I'm, I'm, I'm taking a dude I'll, that's going to have his whole team. Jokic is a dude that's going to get his whole team involved, but also getting his. I, I'm trusting that. So if they I'm match up in a series right now for the first round, if hypothetically the Clippers mm -hmm. and Nuggets play against each other, who you taking? I'm taking the Nuggets. Okay. All right. Hey, hey, Cam, to people watching, I I have nothing but love for LeBron and AD, but I I hope they match up with the fucking Clippers, and I'm putting my money on the fucking Clippers. They better mop the flow with their ass, cause I'm sick of Laker fans acting like that shit's stupid to me, bro. That shit's stupid because when the, whenever the, if the Lakers pull a stunt last year, you would forget about it. You wouldn't be saying, oh, I'm not picking my team, cause they gonna go back to the same ways. They, this this Clipper shit is is stupid, bro. And I don't even want to sound like a Clipper fan, but all the people that's trying to put them in the same thing is it's just dumb. It's just dumb. It's just so dumb. But if y'all gonna fall for it and be stupid and just to count out the Clippers, go right ahead. I'm not. I'm not, bro. I'm just saying down the stretch. I'm, I'm taking the Nuggets over the Clippers. I'm not disregarding the Clippers. The Clippers have a good ass team. I think they the pick up Armando. Oh, they, they don't, hey, it. don't backtrack now. Ain't no backtrack. I said, bro, what did I say? The second teams that I'm I'm like, okay, I don't, I don't want to go against is the Clippers and the Jazz. I said, you that's all. I'm like, ain't talk, no disrespect. Don't put no fear in your heart. That's what, that was your words. They don't. Okay. They, I, don't play, I don't play for the damn Lakers. Cool. Cool. <laughs> no. Last one is Luke Black, who says Mike finna route Kenny on God. Now we can get back. Now we can get. I did. I did. Talk. I did see that comment, and I was like, "What are you? What are you doing?" He know what he talking about, man. I ain't seen no. Does he though? Detective right thing. Let's let's be honest. Does he though? Hey, I got a question for Kenny. Uh -huh. Kenny. What would it look like for D Mills versus Mike at the line? Like D Mike ain't even Mike. I don't even think you blowing past D Mills. No, D D Mills is faster than we than you probably give him credit for. You think um, he's faster than Mike? I yes. think in a full sprint, I am. Yeah, I think he is too. Mike, what you think? Right now, he probably could beat me in a sprint, man. It's been a little minute. So, so how if he can beat you in a sprint, why would you think you can beat me off the? I'm not talking about this again. That's just, just stupid. I, I can use my body on you. You're just a little too small, man. You're gonna that's if you're gonna, gonna use your body five yards out. Of the line of scrimmage, that's a pass interference, interference, motherfucker. You're not, you're no, not a D line man. I'm I mean, talking about when I'm going up for this case. You're not catching the ball over me. You're out your fucking mind, <laughs> we, Michael. We gonna, see, we gonna see. All I need is that look, bro. That you look. got that? Yeah, that's all, that's all the vertical you got. That's all the vertical you have. Hey, all it takes is for me to just extend that. I'm making one hand catches. I'm making one hand. Catches. I've <laughs> seen your hands, bro. You're you're not making. No, -uh. like, you always say I see your hands, but I don't drop passes like. Do this. Look at that fucking baseball mitt. You're not catching a football with that thing, bro. I'm sorry. Well, you crazy, man. Hey, I don't, you and Derek do got a lot of drop passes in our basketball games. Derek is number one, though. He's number okay. one. Okay. Okay. I think there's a. I think there's Derek, a but Derek's excuse is he was an O lineman back in the day, so he don't. He didn't really need hands like that. Hey, I would just, love to line up against Pete. We can make that a little. little thing. No, through, the, no, through the through the Y YouTube video coming soon. Through the Y YouTube channel coming soon. That's line it. Up against me. That's it. Let's set that up, man. I think I can burn you off the line. Uh oh. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. We'll we'll keep That's it. We'll make it a whole series. This is why you can't give people a slight credit because they take an inch and they take a mile with it. Not you can burn me off of off the line. You can burn me. Yeah. See what I'm saying? Like <laughs> you and Mike yeah, are just stupid. Like literally, you can't burn fucking rubber, motherfucker. Now you can just burn me. We'll see. All right. We'll see. We'll see. Letting them 
shoot. No, 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 no. We not doing that. That's what you get though. Just like you will burn me off the line. Oh my gosh, I would love for us to oh, get please. a We're gonna rent that. We're gonna rent that field. One hundred percent gonna rent that field. Break your fucking kneecap trying to do some shit. You know, <laughs> damn well you can't do. Just talking to be talking. Same with Mike. Mike, you burning control off the line? Motherfucker, you can't burn hey. shit but toast. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, all I need is one step. Hey, yes. a less separation. I'm catching the ball, man. I got. But hands. that's the like, thing. How you get this separation? <laughs> right, exactly. That motherfucker is so slow. That's <laughs> hey. All I need is the. I got first of all, I got reach, man. Like I see, I'm catching the ball with one hand. You know what we need? You and D Mills versus me and KB and any fucking thing, because y'all niggas talk out of y'all asses. <laughs> so didn't that happen? That happened, and we beat y'all. There's a video of us in Contrail Oak apartment and y'all was talking about all this shit y'all was gonna do. Oh yeah. And it was like, what? What's it, Mike? Since when the fuck is you doing all of that? Yeah. Didn't we do that and we won? Yeah. It's on Pee Wee. It's on Pee Wee to plug YouTube channel. Uh oh. But He's a what are they talking about? They've been on Reggie Miller for a minute. They were on Reggie Miller and Steph Curry for a long time. We got time. one sentence Who's the about best Kobe. overall athlete here. D Mills. Me, right? D Mills. No, he's the most athletic. Who's the most overall oh. athlete? Stop dick riding. I'm me. <laughs> it's me. It's me. If they spending this much time on Steph and Reggie, I I'm can only imagine how much they spend on, on LeBron. Oh. I would say you're the lowest as well. Yeah. I would say you're the lowest as well. Who is the best baseball player? I am. Me? I am definitely, definitely the best me. baseball player. I'll say me. The rest of y'all? I'm the best first baseman. I'm pretty bad Oh, you baseball. can catch. <sighs> Who's the best saying? football player? Probably me again. I would definitely take me too. Definitely me. You at what? Me at football. <laughs> what what you, can you do? Bro, you gonna get you can't take no contact. What you gonna do, kick? I thought we was talking like running routes and guarding each other. Running routes? Yeah. Because when can you fucking run a route? Okay, we could we could throw in the parking lot. So you would be able to guard me. I, I think ran. I would be, oh yes. Uh -oh. The, I would the best was, corners uh -oh. in the league so are five, six, five, got, seven, five, eight. Yeah. 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 That's what happened to him. This motherfucker got no athleticism. That's what happened to his ass. That ain't nothing. His ass got embarrassed. And I was wearing Jordans. You don't stand a chance. He's okay. O-lineman. Don't sure. stand, yeah, don't stand a chance. Man, that's sure. a DN right you could, you could cover Mike if he ran a route? Hell yeah. I could cover anybody up there. Hell no. Nah. He could cover you? No. I'm dusting you off the line, Derek. I'm sorry. Let's see. That's video the one thing, video that's, coming soon. That's the one thing about Through the Wire. A lot of these guys don't keep it a buck like Antetokounmpo, so... Tough assignment. Hey, bro. I'm still working my way back in shape. I take pride in that defensive end now, bro. Mike, I I, Mike, we've heard you say Y'all gonna see it. Y'all gonna see okay. it. Y'all gonna see okay. it. I'm letting y'all know so it's fresh to y'all. Okay. I'm over mad. But all we want that. for you is to be engaged on defense. We, on engaged defense. On defense. We, we, we don't want to give you the, defense. We, I, we're I, not gonna I give am, you man. no number one assignments. We're just not gonna do, even do that to you. Uh, but just be engaged. I don't need Bro, you. I'm all over the floor, bro. Y'all. Y'all gotta see the new Mike Hoover. Because you got to wait. Y'all can't die. wait. You gonna try to guard somebody best player? Then you gonna be like, that made me tired. That's why I couldn't make no shot. Hell no. Nah. I wanna be a player. But I literally, bro. Anytime I'm at the gym, I probably have like the first and second best player. Then that's because look, part of this is Derek. and at the export. Look, Derek, we don't look. think about it, Derek. If we not what? We not there. Damn, y'all could be there. That's the crazy thing. I invited y'all too many times. What was y'all excuse at? That gym fucking sucks. Yeah, I'm not. You say dusty ass fours. You say that gym sucks because your ass don't like running fools. And you, I'm not people put expectations on you. I'm not finna. I'm not finna pay a dub to go to that lit ass gym. The hell, I one court. You can't even warm up. You Are just you, get thrown into a five. Like it's one dub. fucking court in the whole gym. I'm not paying I'm money paying to go there. We're gonna rent the gym. I, we pay a dub a piece and we rent the entire gym with our fives and tens, and we don't nobody ever have to sub. There ain't no argument. Man, I'm a, I'm gonna go hoop whenever, bro. I'm a hooper. Yeah, you can you can hoop whatever, but you're not. First of all, you're not a hooper. You're not. A hooper. <laughs> That's number one. You don't have a, you don't have a resume. Uh, you don't got to be no fucking D one hooper in the NBA. To but, but I, I'm I hoop. That. If I'm I go to the damn basketball court, I'm gonna be out there hooping. You, you do not have the re the the uh what do they call it? The reputation of he's a hooper. Well, motherfucker. Where at? What, what gym? Nobody. Any gym I go to, they, they put some respect on my name. I'll tell you that. 
Any gym I go to, they put respect on my name. Bro, Any a gym. Nigga, a nigga, Danaeus has respect in certain gyms. I because nobody's talking about that damn YMCA it's, it's a gym. familiarity. I would hope you have a respect. That Downers Grove bro, gym, they, that Downers Grove but, gym, but I'm that Downers Grove gym I went to, I, it had been I two go, years. If I, What I'm saying is, when I have conversations with people that we mutually know, it don't come up as- Who the like, hell knew? Who the hell do you know that see me who? Mike! You who the hell do you know? Mike act like you hooping in Indiana or some shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm asking who? who Majority of the people that you who? know from playing basketball, I, would, I know a long list. Motherfucker, what the hell? We all know the same people. I suck, bro. I suck back when they probably see me hooping, bro. The niggas that you hoop with at export don't fucking... You know how many times I've hooped at export? I don't know them niggas. What the hell? What the fuck? Any gym I hoop at, they put some damn that lifetime had a, gym. Yeah, I go to I go to lifetime gym. I guarantee somebody see me. Oh, guard him. Oh, I me, I got him. Make me, sure you pick Bub, his ass up. Me and Bub had a three year run of export. I don't know them niggas. I don't what that don't what the fuck. Well, I heard you that? talking about. Oh yeah, I know him on Facebook. He told me to come up there. I know him on Facebook. I don't know that nigga. What the <laughs> fuck? What the what, what what was that point you just made? But again, if a Niggas don't know you as a hooper, bro. You're just Mike. <laughs> if I text Darn, if, if Darnie hit me up right now, bro, Darnie don't, hey, Darnie, hey, Mike, Mike Darnie know me from back in the day. Darnie don't, Darnie don't. I see just me ran now. to Marcel. Marcel ain't talking about Mike the hooper or remembered it. Mike said he said he saw you at X Four. That was it. He on top. And then when he said that, he what? He didn't even say you. His reaction to seeing you and what y'all was doing. Wasn't how you be making it seem up here. He wasn't man. Mike was killing. He was guarding the best player. He was the best nigga in the gym. This is fucking export. It, no, it ain't no fucking NBA finals game. I'm not bragging to you about most of the time. Like, oh yeah, I see. How you can have a script flip? You just flipped the script, Mike. You just flipped your script completely. D Mills, I want you to talk. I'm gonna talk back. <laughs> look, 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 look at that. That's what I want to talk to. I want to talk. Nah, no, nah, because I want to talk. Because D Mills loves saying oh, shit about my game. How? I didn't say anything. He, he I, just all I did was point out the obvious that you flipped your whole story. All oh, he's saying was, yeah, I'm saying I am a damn hoop. I'm you, a hooper. My, I don't. I don't give a fuck. Of nobody. I, yeah, it is a saying. If you say something, you you know you're good at something. Like I, or, 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 I'm gonna rewrite. If when you're good at something, you are gonna tell other people. When you're great at something, others gonna tell you. I I know that damn saying too, but. I mean, I, I'm not expecting this motherfucker Mike. Marcel for to be out here. Oh, Mike, this motherfucker. Mike, no, Marcel probably bro, the most Mike. recent dude that probably see me who. Right, that's what I'm saying. So I'm saying if you come up here and you tell us, man, mm -hmm. I've been at the gym, I'm doing X, Y, and Z. If a dude who just recently saw you and I say, oh, what up, boy? He like, oh, how the podcast going? Whatever. I just seen Mike. And I'm like, oh, where at export? And that's all he say. He don't say you was. What do you expect? What do you expect him to say, bro? If a nigga showing the ass, how you telling us you showing your ass? I would expect a nigga to say something about it because I asked him about the games and he was like, oh, I was just regular shit. And I was like, Mike said he was killing. That, he, the he last time I said up there, they want shit up there. Yeah, 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 I, I, I said Mike. There. Mike be saying he be killing, and he start laughing. That's no boy. I would. I wouldn't front on you a lie or try to. That's just the truth. That's funny. And I'm telling you, you hoop. But I, I don't, I don't, I don't think a lot of motherfuckers know you as a hooper. You Next feel? time you see me hoop, you a guy, I'm, like I'm Mike, a you didn't even play varsity basketball. How are you a hooper? Like, first of all, I told you, <laughs> I, when I was in high school, I sucked. I literally started playing my freshman year. I was bad. So that, I, I, and then, the, and then the varsity shit. Like, I'm not even trying to make excuses, but I wasn't at like literally it, only like three juniors made the team. It, it's gonna, it's, so it's gonna be hard for a nigga that that late to be a hooper. You feel me? That's just hard enough to be a hooper. Like, a hooper is a nigga who do this shit, put in a lot of these hours, was doing this their whole life. Not a dude who... But I have. What you think I've been doing since what? I probably started hey, hooping freshman year? I'm going to let you live on that hill, Mike. I'm just letting you know a lot of people... Yeah, I'm not saying I'm, I'm not a lot D1 of, down, hey, but hey, I'm, I'm telling you. You don't have to be D1. I'm not I, I'm not D1 either. I know a lot of niggas that ain't D1. Some I know some... Right. some, some I know players. hooper hoopers that are not D1. Exactly. He's right. So, with that being said, I'm just telling you, my brother, a lot of people that you know, that know, know you, they're not going to say it's from basketball. Well, if you're a hooper, a lot of niggas that know you, they going to know you for hooping. Yeah. That's what, that's a hooper. Oh, and I, I'm trying I, to say, I, I that, the, about the people you talk about that know me. Played on the, the same team. About, played nobody was saying, there. nobody was saying I'm a damn hooper. Like, I'm just, and, and, and back, I'm like I said, and that's what I said. I've, I've grown, I've grown into a, I feel like I'm probably oh, my best basketball player feels. ever right he now. He just said nobody's saying that he's a hooper after he just back, said he's a hooper. I'm talking about back then in high school. Like, like I said, I sucked back then. 
I really I want all shit. Nobody, there's like nobody look. And it's a little, listen, I'm gonna put it in the same way because I think this is a good comparison. The same shit you like, um, same shit you said to D Mills about like females, like he needs to go outside of people that he already know. There is once somebody already has that mentality or kind of has that grasp of who you are, it does take a lot to change that shit. Like, no girls probably think of like looking at D Mills and not gonna think about what he was in high school and shit like that. People are gonna feel the same way. Unless you see me who consistently now. I hear you're you. probably you're, gonna be like, oh, he, you're, he, he probably had you. own shit. You're a better right. basketball player than when you was a kid. Way better. 99% of people that play basketball with us in high school are probably gonna be better because you're just grown, you know more, you're fucking faster, stronger, you're not a little kid anymore. That's almost everybody. I don't and know anybody that, anybody that we hooped with in high school, I don't I've never hooped with them and been like, damn, he's regressed. <laughs> from from high school to his, his mid twenties, he's regressed. Damn, Ontario. The, he, no, I, I like no. Nobody's gotten worse. But still, what I'm telling you is, and all I'm telling you is the difference between a guy who hoops and a hooper. Whether you know the difference or not is with you. But I'm just letting I'm you know. I'm a hooper, bro. You shouldn't walk I, around I'm a, saying I'm you're a hooper, hooper because majority of the people that you know do not know you from hooping. And there's not a lot of guys that's going to go around vouching and respecting your name because they don't, you don't, that's not who you are, Mike. Niggas don't know you from hooping. You can live in a false reality world. Bro, oh, you, oh, you talk brother. about motherfuckers that ain't seen we me in four, five years. It don't matter, Mike. We when the last two. time they see me hoop? <laughs> Shit, when we played meals? Because you're And not I would, and I ain't, because and I still, and what happened? Hurt. And what, I ain't hooped in a damn year. I stepped on the court and still bust that man ass. Right. Who was fucking right. at the gym doing D all this shit? D Mills isn't a guy you should brag about beating, though, bro. You beat him. What did he do? Bro, I know. And, and, and I'm, and I'm not that saying that's some shit I'm dying up. on top you of the hill. I'm saying your, I step on the court. I step on the that court. Should be a I'm going to get the hoop in. I understand, but that shouldn't be a card you pull out to validate yourself, bro. It's D Mills. If you're a hooper like you saying you are, you ain't pulling out no D Mills car. That's only when y'all going at it and you want to talk shit to him. But you don't walk around and say, "Oh, Pierre saying I'm not a hooper to validate myself. I just beat D Mills." What the fuck? No, no, oh. I'm trying to. I put that shit as a reference. Is I ain't hooped in a fucking year. I ain't shot a damn ball, and I came out there and I did that to a man hey, that was talking hey, all that shit. Hey, and I'm, live, and I'm trying to live, bring the point. Live in a false reality, all you want, my brother. As a friend and a guy who knows you personally, I would not consider you a hooper. Brother, okay, that's when's the last I'm time you see me. When's the last time you see it? Me ain't a, says, Mike. That's what I'm saying. You, I'm, you, done, you, I'm done. I'm done. That's it. That was 15 minutes. It was 15 minutes. It was 15 minutes. It was 15 minutes. minutes. How you gonna judge somebody? You that's enough. Watch. That's enough. Y'all talking in circles. Y'all talking in circles. Because Mike got a false reality. What the fuck? It was inter. It was entertaining. Stop. Stop. It was entertaining. It's it's over. I'm gonna be done when you ask this question, Katrina, and be truthful. Mike is your homie, homie, like your fucking brother. Before we did this podcast, you should, you used to talk about Mike. So I know on some real shit is in your mind when you talk about is Mike a, a guy who hoops and he can play basketball. I'm not saying you're a bum, Mike. I'm not. I'm not saying it at all. But there's a difference. Do you consider Mike out of the hoopers that you know, Contrell? Is he a hooper or a guy that can hoop and does hoop? Mike, you're really good at basketball, but I don't. I don't think you're a hooper. That's no bias, Derek. I'm just we just keeping it a buck. We but all like 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 Mike again, yeah, yeah. It's not like out of our friend group, you're literally one of the best. But like there, it's semantics at the end of the day. The term Hooper, I'm thinking about motherfuckers that's that's in that bitch every day and dominating. That's what I think about when I hear There's the word Hooper. No that's all for hooping. You, how do you know Otis from basketball? That Nothing motherfucker, else. yeah, he's a Hooper, he's right? A that's a Hooper. Hooper, yeah. How do you know Joffrey from fucking hooping? I know yeah, the but, nigga from school, but I went to school with him. But I, I know him from I know him from hooping. That was a bad, yeah, yeah. I know him from I didn't go to school with him, but I know him Derek, from hooping. Is Mike one of our friends who hoops and he's good at it? Yeah. Or is he a hooper? He plays basketball and he's good at it. That's all I'm saying, Mike. That's okay though, Mike. Like that's not that's not a bad thing. I would never get up here and try to drag your name. Anybody who's ever asked me about playing basketball with y'all. I've always spoken highly about everybody up here. I'm not, I don't go, my dad, like, oh, you at the gym, you hoop. I ain't know them dudes hoop. Mike and D Mills can hoop. Hell yeah. And I told him, especially when D Mills was in shape, but Mike is a, he's a bucket. Bub, we went to go hoop with Bub at the time Kyron came. Bub wanted you to hoop because I vouched for you. Oh yeah, Mike can hoop. What the hell? Nobody's ever gonna discredit you or say you was a bum. I'm look, just telling you, bro. You not. No and that's where I'm gonna show. Niggas ain't walking around. Look, with okay, this is the last statement. This is the last statement. This is the last statement. Go ahead. And I'm gonna just say, 
I heard all y'all said, and this is where I feel like I've also grown as a person because I can admit, I, I agree with y'all say. I like what y'all say. I, I don't know why I, it took I, 20 I, I minutes, still, but I still, hey. classify, I still classify. We have different interpretations. I, I consider myself a hooper. Okay. That's what I do. Okay. Different interpretations of it. All right. I respect what y'all said, and I'm gonna just say this: I can't wait back to get back on the court with y'all because y'all some of my favorite people to hoop with. Exactly. Nothing some of some damn. More basketball. We need some more basketball stories Nothing too. Nothing changes, Mike. We still love hooping with you. We still think highly of you. But you, come don't on, you, you don't know who you're talking to. I we don't do don't. shit but talk about each other all damn day. <laughs> Okay, I'm just making sure I don't want nobody to think, you know what I'm saying? That's, that was more that's comments. more for the comments, right? That was that's, more yeah, for the that's comments. the comments oh. that be thinking like, oh they they finna beef with each other. No. Yeah. Go talk, yeah. Go talk, yeah. Go talk, my nigga. It's go talk. Go talk. Go talk. Go talk, my nigga. That's go talk. Go talk. Go talk. Go talk, my nigga. It's go talk. Go talk. Go talk. Go talk, my nigga, this go talk.